that's pretty crazy. What's up everyone? Today's video is going to be a story time and I'm going to tell you about when I worked at Wendy's and when I quit Wendy's. So I even have my visor. I thought I still had my full uniform but I couldn't find the rest of it. But I still got this so thank god. So we'll start at the beginning. So. I applied there because I actually wanted to work at a grocery store that's close to my house but I hadn't heard back from them yet so I was like all right let me apply to some more places so I applied to Wendy's it was brand new like just gonna open like 10 minutes from my house so I applied I heard back from the people they were like hey come in for an interview so I went to an interview and it was basically like when I showed up it was so busy there. It was all of the Wendy's people who were hired, so they were all in their uniforms. It was like everybody got together to like meet each other and exchange numbers and all that. So I went in, I met with like the manager, whoever does the interviews, and they asked me a bunch of questions. I got the job right on the spot. They gave me a uniform and everything. I was like, all right. So I got a pin, I got a uh, apron type thing, a butt, like a whole outfit and they were like all right like so glad to have you on the team they're all really nice there I started my next shift i showed up and they were like oh this lady's gonna be training you so she was training me and it was so busy there like the first day they were open i think so i had to like clean the trays pick up the tables i like had to wipe down the windows basically just cleaning everything so the lady was showing me how to do it like what cleaning supplies you use, all of that. So I did that, we were so busy the whole day, like I didn't have like a break, anything, like I was going the whole time. And of course, tons of people from my school went, like I saw so many people, like one of my teachers went, like so many people went. I was like, what the heck, like I don't wanna see all you people here. So that happened and it was just a lot of work, but I was like, okay, like is fine just keep doing it so, so when you're on shift you can get free stuff so like say it's the end of your shift you can get like a free soda all about that free stuff you know my second shift I showed up thinking like oh they're gonna train me in something else or I'll just be doing that job I show up and there's this new girl there she was super nice and they tell me that I'm going to be training the new girl and I've had one shift. I literally worked there one shift and they were having me train new people. I was like, um, what? So I had to train this new girl when I barely knew what I was doing myself. So I tr like was telling her what to do, like, oh, this is what they taught me. She was like, oh my God, this is so much work. Like we were a few hours in at that point and she was like, I don't know if I can do this. Like. I think I'm gonna quit. Like the girl was like freaking out and I was like, all right, like this is my second shift too. Like this, is, I don't know. Like I'm not here to give advice. Like I don't even know. So I was like, oh, just like relax. Like why don't you just like have a drink and just like sit down for a second and relax. Like take a break, I guess. And so she was like that and I was like, all right. Like I don't really even, this is like stressing me out. So I had to train the girl. I don't know if she kept working there or not, but it was overall just really crazy. And they'd have you train people when you just started yourself. So that happened. Went home that day thinking like, what the heck? Then after that, and like between my next shift, I had actually gotten a call and an interview from the grocery store that I wanted to work at and I got that job. So I was like, all right, like this Wendy's deal is pretty crazy. Um, I don't know what's going on here. So I actually went in for my next shift. I was like, oh, like, I'm really sorry. Like, but deuces, like this is too much for me. So I quit after only two shifts. So that is my story uh, time for working at Wendy's. The people were awesome. The experience was like out of control. I don't know like why I was training people on my second shift, but yeah. And now since I quit my job there after two shifts, I don't like going to that Wendy's. So like we went a couple days later after I quit and I literally hid in the back seat of the car when my mom went through the drive-thru because I was like, okay, I don't wanna see people that I was working with. 
but now I think it's chill. Like they would not even recognize me. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. 